What's up everyone, welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Before we begin, make sure to hit the like and subscribe and then hit the real subscribe button which is the bell icon. We're posting 4 videos every day so make sure to check back every single day. We're aiming for 20k subscribers and get the deal in the description if you haven't already. Plenty of free crypto and goodies down there. This is not financial advice, welcome to Crypto Maximalist, let's begin. What's up guys, so just before we begin, make sure to hit the subscribe and the bell icon. People aren't seeing our content and this is probably because you haven't hit the bell icon. Thank you again for all your support. The algorithm is slamming a lot of content creators right now, so we really appreciate all your support. And we're so proud of the amazing community that we've built. So make sure to jump into the Telegram and the free Discord. So we're just taking a super quick look at Veracity here and as we can see, really not much has happened over the past few days at all. On the hourly time frame here, you can see still consolidating, still inside of our range that we were talking about. Obviously, we had this range here that we came up and down and up and down and up and down. And then on the 10th of November, Bitcoin dragged Veracity down to its next level of support. With the market rolling over, we come down, we find support on that previous all-time high around 5.7 cents. We get the bounce, we come down again to around that 5.3 cent level. You can see here, resistance, support, resistance, support. We get the overextension, um, basically all the way down to around, what was this, 5.1-ish cents. For Veracity here on the swing low, but we actually wick all the way back up. We wick all the way back up here inside of our range. So super bullish show of support here, obviously with the the bullish divergences as well. It was a pretty, pretty obvious no-brainer that we were going to get the bounce pretty soon. And then you can see here, we come up, we come back down and we're currently just bouncing in and around that previous all-time high level at around 5.7 cents. <laughs> and you can see here, Veracity really, it's still looking very good, isn't it? We've got this massive run-up, as we always say, huge correction. And then since then, we've been heading up higher highs and higher lows to the upside. Very, very good in our opinion and clearly showing, you know, a lot of demand for the token and basically all the dips being bought up very nicely indeed. And we'd say realistically, you know, Veracity over the past few days, not really much happening at all. So we'll keep things really, really short and sweet because there's really not much going on right now for Veracity. Apart from, you know, there potentially is some rumblings of some more fundamental bullish news coming out pretty soon. Obviously, everyone's saying that there's going to be a massive adoption by the end of uh, Q4 of this year for a tier one, uh, tier one integration with a big uh, platform. It could potentially be YouTube, which would obviously be absolutely insane if that was the case. But beyond that, Veracity is still consolidating, still chopping it sideways, basically waiting for Bitcoin, we think, to make a move to the upside. Or if it does start to have a little ramp up for itself, then, you know, we're looking for those fundamental news. Obviously, um, an actual full main Binance listing would be absolutely insane as well. But overall, Veracity is still looking really strong, holding support really well, consolidating, waiting for that next move. So if we roll over, obviously, as we always say, that 5.3 cent level here at the bottom of this range would be a good level of support. And then beyond that, heading to the upside, we do think that 6.7 cent level upwards to around that 6.9 cent level would be pretty good as well. So we'd say Veracity is currently just ranging, isn't it? And until we break the range, that's what we'll be doing. But beyond that, we do think with Veracity being so strong as it has been, that realistically, we could be looking at a massive pump for it pretty damn soon, heading to the upside and basically, you know, heading up towards a uh, We'd say 50 cents to $1 if it does really start to ramp up and get that par parabolic move that we're looking for. So I'd like to thank everyone so much for their support. If you've got any questions or suggestions, please leave them down below and don't forget to subscribe and then hit the real subscribe button, which is the bell icon to stay up to date with four videos we post every single day. Remember, if you want to support the channel more directly and get a ton of benefits and insight, as well as joining our growing community, consider the Patreon or YouTube membership down below. There are three tiers giving you access to our private Discord. Crypto support is available if you just want to help us out a small amount. Crypto Maximalist is our main tier, which gives you access to detailed daily technical analysis and signals, weekly and monthly coin calls, and insights into our personal moves, while Maximalist Gold takes it a step further, giving you an insight into our personal portfolio tracker, super low cap gem research, and a 100x portfolio we're constructing and updating, and access to us personally as a resource to discuss your portfolio via Messenger make sure to check it out. You can also sign up to our free Telegram and public Discord via the description as well. All the links are in the description for affiliate links for discounts and free crypto. So go check them all out below. There's plenty of goodness on offer. Please like and subscribe. We are Crypto Maximalists.